And they're bringing in the big guns to deal with that park, uh, that uh, fire up in the park. A Type 1 incident management team has arrived for a briefing on the Howe Ridge fire burning in Glacier, and they'll assume control of that blaze later in the week. The team is assessing the fire to get a better understanding of the current resources, what they're going to need going forward to get a handle on this one. Fire Information Officer Diane Sign says, with growth expected on all sides of the fire, the terrain continues to be a hazard with the threat of falling trees and snags from previous fires. Sign says the park is happy to have extra assistance from the Type 1 team, and they're thankful for the additional resources they'll be bringing. Type 1 team generally comes with their own meteorologist, so someone who can actually get out onto the ground, take measurements, um, put in weather stations, really figure out what's happening in this specific locale. We'll have fire behavior analysts who will be able to analyze what's likely to happen based specifically on our terrain, our weather, our fuel loads. Not much change in the size of the fire now. It's still at 2,600 acres. And a reminder, the fire is only impacting the west side of the park. The east side is open up to Logan Pass. And a reminder also, the following areas will enter stage two fire restrictions tonight at midnight. Flathead National Forest, Flathead, Lincoln, Sanders, and Lake Counties, the cities of Whitefish and Columbia Falls, DNRC Northwest Office Lands, those state lands, Libby and Plains units, and the Kootenai National Forest. That means campfires and other fires prohibited everywhere. Smoking is prohibited outside buildings, vehicles, and developed recreation sites. Also, no internal combustion engines can operate between the hours of 1 p.m. and 1 a.m.